I've got the NFC version of the Poco X3 and today I'm going to show you how to boot the Xiaomi Poco X3, the Poco X3 NFC, and the Poco X3 Pro both into fast boot mode as well as how to exit fast boot mode. Now we can actually boot into fast boot mode a couple of different ways. One method is the button combination, while the other method is an ADB command. This video I'm going to be focusing on the button combination, but if you're curious on the ADB command, I'll be including that in the video description below. So the goal for us to boot into fastboot mode is to get the phone into a powered off state. So if you are currently in Android, then we simply need to bring up the power menu and shut down the phone. However, if your phone is currently in a boot loop and it is restarting again and again, then you're going to need to time when you press these two buttons. You're going to want to press these two buttons right whenever you see the phone shut down and reboot. So when you're ready to boot the Poco X3 into fast boot mode, we're simply going to press and hold the power button as well as the volume down buttons. We need to press and hold both of those buttons and we're going to continue holding both of those buttons even after we feel that phone vibrate. So as you saw, the phone was in a powered off state. I pressed the power and the volume down buttons at the same time and then I continued holding those two buttons down past the feeling of the phone vibrating with that Poco splash screen and then I let go of those two buttons once I saw this little Russian Xiaomi Mi doll appear. This is the same fast boot mode that we would get to if we booted into the special boot mode via ADB. The only difference was how we got into it either by button combination or by executing an ADB command. Now, while we are in fast boot mode, this is where we would start to execute fast boot commands. For instance, this would be where we plug in our phone to the PC and say, try to unlock the bootloader or flash a custom kernel or flash a custom recovery. We would do that from fast boot mode, which we are in right now. I'll be doing tutorials like this in the future, showing you things like how to unlock the bootloader and install custom ROMs. But today I just wanted to focus on showing you how to boot into fastboot mode, as well as how to take the Poco X3 and boot out of fastboot mode. So we can exit fastboot mode on the Poco X3 Pro, the Poco X3 NFC, and the base model simply by pressing and holding the power button. Once we press and hold the power button, we're going to continue holding that button for about 7 to 10 seconds. We're just going to continue holding that button down until the phone reboots, just like you saw. The phone is going to go through the typical boot animation sequence. And then it's going to boot us right into Android and Xiaomi's MIUI firmware. Now I do want to point out that if you have tried booting out of fastboot mode and back into Android like I just did, but your phone rebooted back into fastboot mode, or, for example, say we rebooted into recovery mode. That means the phone attempted to boot into Android and it failed. I can't tell you why it failed. This can be from any number of reasons. However, I can suggest you then try to boot the phone into recovery mode so that you can do a factory data reset and recover your Android operating system. Again, I'll be showing you how to boot into recovery mode 
in a future tutorial. So if you are curious about that, be sure to check the channel and find that video. But that wraps up today's tutorial on how to boot the Xiaomi Poco X3 both into fast boot mode as well as how to exit fast boot mode.